USA, Elite Total Body Care, and Private Label Hair Care Company. I hope everybody's having an amazing morning. Um, I wanted to come on live and do kind of like a demo for you guys of a new product that we'll be launching coming very soon. Um, we've listened to a lot of your concerns. We've listened to a lot of our pros telling us exactly what you need for your hair to help with your hair care and to also allow you to be able to go further in your journey. So with that being said, one of the main things that we've heard from you guys or one of the main pain points or complaints or issue or whatever you want to call that word that we've heard from you guys is how to get your hair to look more shiny, to have the appearance of more luster. For those of you who are trying to regain or re-strengthen or regrow your hair, this is definitely one of the main things that I hear about the most. So with that being said, yesterday during the live, I mentioned it slightly and I said today would be a great day for me to show you guys how you are able to add shine to your hair and it actually lasts for a couple of weeks. It does not damage the hair whatsoever. So I want to introduce to you guys, this is not the bottle that this treatment comes in. So don't worry about the bottle, okay? I just used this bottle because I wanted to show it to you guys in this bottle. But this is called Elite Shine Boosting Treatment, okay? So Elite Shine Boosting Treatment. Now, how this treatment works, you place it on the hair so it is a conditioning treatment as well as a shine boosting treatment. Now, a lot of times people see or hear the word shine and you think shine like shiny, like this. In hair, shiny is a slight luster. It's an enhance of the luster on the hair. You'll walk around and sometimes see people with coarse textured hair, natural hair, sometimes even relaxed hair. The hair has a very dull finish. And typically what you wanna do is add spray. You to spray, 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 spray. Well, that spray is gonna get absorbed and then you have to do it all over again. So with the shine boosting treatment, this treatment conditions the hair at the same time and adds that actual glaze over the hair to give it back the luster that you're missing. This treatment can be used whether you are natural, relaxed, low porosity, high porosity, Caucasian, African American, Spanish, Japanese, Jamaican, Trinidadian, whatever you want to be, you can use this treatment to enhance or boost the shine in your hair, right? So you guys have noticed that as you become elite hair care pros, that our products are really on the pro side, okay? Typically, shine boosting treatments are not sold to the public. Typically, this is an in-service um, option because usually stylists are the ones that will offer this particular service. Well, 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 you know, Elite Hair Care USA was created by a professional. Hello, I am a licensed cosmetologist. So my line of products are placed in the line of professional products that can be utilized by you the consumer at retail pricing. 90% of the time, these kinds of products, protein treatments, that kind of thing, that are professional strength or professional grade are very hard to come by. And you pay a very good penny for them. But Elite Hair Care USA is here to put you all in the game and make your hair care situation a lot easier. So, I actually already shampooed my hair. I shampooed my hair last night at home. I did not condition my hair. So it air dried, that's why it's sitting off the top of my head, okay? That is why it's sitting like this. Um, I wanted to wait until I got into the salon today because I wanted you guys to be able to see how the treatment is done and the end result, all right? I don't have a whole heap of time, so I'm gonna go ahead and start the treatment. So, how you do this treatment, you can pre-treat your hair, okay? So for those of you that have been asking about the Soothe Me pre-treatment, you are able to pre-treat your hair. This can be used on color-treated hair. This can be used on relaxed hair or natural hair, okay? So it doesn't matter what you have in your hair. The great thing about it is if you are color-treated, this is going to enhance that shine on top of that color-treated hair, okay? It can be used on wigs. It can be used on extensions. It can be used on your actual hair as well, and it works all the way across the board. So. When you're doing this at home, typically your hair would be wet at this point because you have shampooed it. The great thing is whether your hair is wet or dry, as long as it is clean and ready to go, 
okay and you had just shampooed that hair you really want to make sure that you had just did your wash day you don't want to wait a couple days later you can go ahead and start the treatment so i'm going to use my camera as my mirror if you guys notice i am barehanded okay the reason why i decided to do it barehanded is because i wanted you guys to understand how this product works a lot of times people think that this is some sort of chemical reaction and it's going to do something to you no the great thing about the shine boosting treatment is it is a semi-permanent glaze, okay? So this will not affect your relaxer. It will not affect or change your curl pattern. It won't do any of that. It will actually give you the appearance of your hair being extremely healthy looking. It will also help to fill those gaps within the cuticle. It will also boost that shine and it serves as a deep conditioning treatment all at the same time. So you'll use whichever elite hair care shampoo you want to use first. If you want to do a pre-treatment first, this is going to be your deep conditioner. So you do not do another conditioner with this. Okay. I do also want to make sure that we understand as well. If you're doing a chemical service, you typically want to stick with whatever conditioner goes with that chemical service. This would be something you do after your chemical service is completely done and you've gone on with your life and now your wash day has come. Okay. All right. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put it in my hair. Okay. Now, if the hair is dry, you're going to use a lot more product than you would if the hair was wet. I don't want to mess up my work clothes. Probably should have put a cape on. So basically what I'm doing is I'm putting the treatment all over my hair. Okay. So I'm saturating my hair with the treatment. If you wanted to, you could also just wet your hair down so that you don't use as much product. But you know, Crystal always got to do stuff fit fast. So I'm showing you guys the other way. And this treatment can be done like once every four to six weeks. Some people like to, they want that shine boost every two weeks. You can do it every two weeks. It will not hurt the hair, you guys, in no shape or form. Let me make sure I get my hairline really well. I'll answer you guys' questions in just a moment. Let me just apply. Happy New Year. Okay. So, my hair is fully saturated. I feel like right here is kind of dry. something I'm gonna take our one of our brushes from the detangle me kit okay and I'm just gonna distribute the treatment all through my hair this step is definitely a step that you don't want to skip okay this is going to really distribute the treatment all over your hair so that every strand is touched once again, we're bringing you another professional treatment that typically only pros offer. And when I say pros, I mean cosmetologists in the salon. Okay, so it's nice and thick. Now, if you guys remember, I always tell you guys that it's definitely important that you have a sit under dryer, okay? There's a reason why the sit under dryer is very important in hair care because for you to do treatments such as these deep conditioning treatments you definitely need to have a hooded dryer someone just asked the question i have a sensitive scalp would it still be good to use this does not interact with the scalp whatsoever the most that i will honestly say will happen is let's say you just got a relaxer and you got burned anything you put on the hair at that point is going to tingle but it will stop but honestly, that's because the scalp is irritated, not because the product is doing something to you. This is a deposit only semi-permanent. That's it. Deposit only semi-permanent conditioning treatment. It does not interact with anything. It doesn't cause any sort of irritation. It is not that kind of product, you guys. This is really 
for external results, but it also gives that appearance of healthy hair. Okay, so you know whenever your hair is nice and shiny, the first thing people say is, girl, what is, what is, what are you doing to your hair? Your hair is so shiny. It looks so healthy. That's exactly what this does. All right, so I'm going to put on a processing cap. So when you guys hear me say processing cap, this is exactly what I mean. I want to put this on, cover my entire head. Rinse my hands. Here's the next great thing to this. No matter if you are fine, medium, or coarse textured, it will not weigh the hair down. It will not weigh the hair down. Do you use this instead of a regular conditioner? Yes, this is considered your deep conditioning treatment because it is an actual conditioner as well. So this is a deep conditioning treatment at this point. We're about to go under the dryer and we're about to get this party going. I'll answer your questions in one minute, you guys. Let me go under the dryer. As you guys know, I gotta start work shortly. So my dryer is set to 10 to 15 minutes-ish. All right, so I'm gonna bring you guys in front of me here because I need to get up under here. My dryer is on hot, okay? So it is hot. You want to make sure that the dryer is hot. I'll be doing a couple more demonstrations even in the midst of this because the product itself is not ready for release yet. And when I say ready for release yet, that means that we're still in bottling labeling phase. All right, so let me go back to some of your questions. Okay, so we'll go down here. Thanks for sharing. My hair is the same length and I'll definitely be using these tips on my hair journey. Thank you. Can you still use it if you get a few tracks in your hair? So here's the thing, Melissa, this is not a styling product. This has to be done during the wash day phase of your service. So if you have tracks in and you are shampooing your hair, let's say those tracks are sewn in and you're shampooing your hair, yes, you can use it, but at the same time, if it's sewn in on top of a braid, that braid won't really get the treatment as much, so you'll probably have to do it again once you take those tracks out. But if they're glued in, I'd wait until it's time for you to redo that and you do that at the time before you go and put your new tracks in. Do you use this instead of a regular conditioner? I think I answered that one, yes. I always get this dip or thinning in the middle of my hair. That's a hair care Q&A question. All right, so what I'm doing right now is I'm under the dryer, okay? The treatment is on. That's another thing that I wanna mention to you guys. If you have color treated hair, when I say color treated hair, let's say your hair is colored, it's red, it's copper, pink, green, blue, whatever. This treatment is only going to enhance that color even more by adding a brilliant shine to that actual color. So it is not going to strip your color. It's not going to make it any less of life in regards to how long that color will last. That actually, this is actually gonna be like more like a protective glaze and it's gonna add a little more life to your color as well as give you that appearance of that brilliant shine. It's gonna make that hair appear to be even healthier than before. It's gonna leave the hair nice and soft because it is a conditioning treatment. It's bomb. How often should it be used? You can do it anywhere from two weeks to six weeks to 12 weeks. You can do it four times a year. You can do it one time a month. You can do it twice a month. It does not harm the hair in any way, shape, or form. This is taking the place of your deep conditioner for that service. So let's say we're doing, let's go to the recipe book. So for those of you that have your recipe book, I want you to go to your recipe book if you have it. If you are on YouTube, you know you can't close your YouTube. 
But if you have your recipe book, we're gonna go to the Elite Hair Care Pro recipe book and we're gonna use one of the recipes. And I'm gonna show you where this treatment would fall in line in that recipe. I gotta wait for it to download again. In the meantime, of it downloading i know yesterday you guys saw me kind of briefly introduce the new look to one of our serums and the new and improved version of the other serum so these our are our new looks of our serums okay so this is the goddess hair repair serum if you guys look it has a shiny gold collar this is our new and improved super growth serum okay this is the new and improved super growth serum and it is a water-based serum it is water-based so this can be used um in between your weaves this can be used if you have fine textured hair this can be you listen okay that's all i can tell you i'm just like i'm ready okay so it is a water-based serum it is not an oil-based serum so this can be used on any hair type, no matter if you are white, black, Asian, Australian, Japanese, whatever, you can use it. All right. So our professional hair care recipe book just downloaded. So for those of you that got this recipe book for free, or if you purchased it, go ahead and open that book. And I'm going to tell you where you would put the shine boosting treatment in this recipe. So I'm going to use the recipe for winter dry hair. Okay, winter dry hair. That is this recipe. Winter dry hair. Okay. So the ingredients for the winter dry hair would be the moist repair sulfate free shampoo, the moist me 24 karat mask, the moist repair leave in conditioner, the elite detangling comb or detangling kit a handheld hydration steamer or a hooded dryer so let's talk about how this would be done first you are definitely going to still shampoo your hair using the moist repair sulfate free shampoo you are still going to towel dry your hair and leave it damp okay so you're still going to towel dry your hair and you're going to leave it damp at step three is where you would now replace the moist me 24 karat mask with the shine boosting treatment so you would replace the product on step number three which is the moist me 24 karat mask you would replace that with the shine boosting treatment and sit under a hooded dryer with a processing cap for about 15 to 20 minutes okay in this particular case you cannot use your handheld steamer because this treatment needs a hooded dryer for it to work the steamer is gonna steam the hair. We don't want the hair to steam. We want the hair to be dry heat processed. So this is another reason why you're gonna use a processing cap and sit under your hooded dryer for 15 to 20 minutes. After complete, you're going to rinse thoroughly, just like you normally would, and you are going to rinse with what temperature water? Who can tell me what temperature water? I don't need the degree. I need to know hot, warm, or cold that we are going to rinse our shine boosting treatment. What temperature water are we gonna use? Can you cocktail with a regular conditioner? No, it's not needed. Thank you, Deneen. Cool water. Any conditioning treatment you do, you are going to rinse with cool water. So thank you guys so much. Grasshopper, Linda, Brenda, um, Shanette, RT Living, Lisa, Bonita, thank you, you guys. You are going to use cool or cold water to rinse the hair because this is still a conditioning treatment and a shine boosting treatment. So both still need cool water, okay? Step number four says that you're gonna detangle your hair using the detangling kit. If you guys just noticed when I placed it on my hair, I had to go through and comb or brush through my hair first anyway to ensure that it was distributed. So when you go to rinse your hair, detangling will be very, very easy because you've already pre-detangled. Now, let's talk about something. Let's say after you do the shine boosting treatment, the hair feels slightly rough and not to your liking in regards to the softness. You are able to use the Hydra Strength 
leave-in conditioning spray that is going to soften and detangle the hair or you can follow it up with the Morse Mead 24 karat mask as an instant conditioner just to detangle the hair and rinse it out so that that is an optional thing lastly you're going to spray on your leave-in conditioner which is exactly what you're going to do that's very important so right now as i feel my cap my hair is nice and hot that means that it is opening the cuticle and depositing that conditioner that's number one but it is also activating that shine boosting treatment very important the dryer of this the dryer phase of this particular service is definitely required you guys i know a lot of you try to skip out on getting a hooded dryer but to be quite honest to have a really good hair care regimen, a, a sit under dryer is probably one of the most important things. Mm -hmm. Thank you guys so much for answering that question in regards to the cold water. Now let's do a quick review because I know a lot of you want to make sure that you have the steps right. Can the shine boosting treatment well, let me say it right. Shine boost, shine boosting conditioning treatment be utilized on any texture of hair. Yes or no? Can it be utilized on any texture of hair? Yes or no? Yes, you have to have a sit under dryer. Thank you, Lisa. Thank you, Melissa. Thank you, Deneen. Yes, the answer is yes. It does, it can be applied to any texture of hair. Question number two, would this treatment still require you to do another deep conditioner? Will this treatment still require you to do another deep conditioner, yes or no? No, the answer is no, correct. You will not do another deep conditioner, but you can utilize an instant conditioner if the hair is not feeling as soft as you would like it to for your particular preference. Good guys. Question number three. What is one of the main benefits of the shine boosting conditioning treatment? What is one of the main benefits? healthier looking hair yep conditioning your hair thank you melissa the answer i was looking for was shine it is going to add that shine back into the hair thank you so much all right so my dryer's cooling down dryer's cooling down now can this treatment be applied to color treated hair. Can it be applied to color treated hair? Yes or no? Yes, it can be applied to color treated hair. Can you recommend a good sit under dryer other than Conair? I am going to um, put one in the description box. And to be, I'm going to be quite honest, the Conair one is probably one of the better ones, especially for the price. Um, and I'll tell you guys why. You can get the Golden Hot. They have the Golden Hots at the beauty supply stores. They're sometimes on sale. But Conair is one that you can typically get at a very good price on Amazon. I'm all about convenience. All about convenience, you guys. Um, so you can get that on Amazon. I am going to put the link in my description box of this video so that you can get 
excuse me, so that you can get um, a sit under dryer if you don't already have one. So you guys just give me a second. I'm just letting my hair cool down because before you rinse any form of shine or semi-permanent treatment or whatever the case may be, you want the hair to cool down. You want it to cool down and you want the cuticle to snap close first. I'll put the link in the description box of this video um, after the video is over because it's not going to let me do it now. I'm located in Florida. All right. So I'm just letting it cool down. This treatment is very thick. And I'm not saying very thick like it weighs the hair down. But you know that it's on your hair. It's, it's nice and thick. It's like a custard almost. I have a soft bonnet dryer, but if I put that thing on hot, my soul will burn. No, those um, dryers that you attach to your blow dryer are not my friend. Um, I don't like those. Um, how long for the cool down? Just a minute or two. The hair cools really quickly. You can tell when your hair is cool because your scalp feels cool. All right, so I'm going to head over to the shampoo bowl here. There we go. I'm just going to go through and use this as my detangler as well again. Now, because I know I'm going to hold my head down, I'm going to move my hair forward in the detangling process so that I don't have to deal with that. I'm going to turn my water to cold slash cool. It is not the most comfortable for a rinse, but it definitely is important. All right, so let's go ahead and rinse my hair. Let me take my earrings out really quick. Let's do the rinse. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and towel dry my hair. And I'm gonna take some leave-in conditioner. In this case, I'm gonna use the Moist Me, which is the new Moist Me leave-in conditioner. to my chair so that I can mold my hair and turn my dryer on sorry you guys I'm moving you guys with me all right so my hair towel dried I can already see the shine and my hair is just wet right now, but I can already see the shine. I don't like my 
here sopping wet. All right, so I'm gonna take, yeah, you can see it. And my hair is nice and light. I only have a couple strands of hair, y'all, so my hair is nice and light. All right, so we're gonna put a little bit of wrap foam. Y'all see this? Okay. I wouldn't recommend a bonnet dryer, Cynthia. I would definitely recommend, if you're all into caring for your hair, to just go ahead and invest and get you a good bonnet, I mean, a good hooded dryer. It's a very, very mild fragrance. It's not even something that would be overbearing at all. It's very mild in fragrance. So I'm going to be doing a down style only because I need a relaxer at this point and I'm holding out until I get my hair cut next week. So I'm using our Elite Silk Wrap Foam. As you guys know, that's my go-to. Hell, my hair is shining through the wrap foam. <laughs> Yes. All right, so because I need a relaxer, I know I need to use one of these strips because this baby will not hold without it. So now I'm going to go under the dryer, let my hair dry. I have my client this morning, so you guys might not get to see the style, but I will add, um, I will add a story to my YouTube stories so that you guys can see my hair when it's dry. So I'll add that to my YouTube story so you guys can see my hair when it's dry. In the meantime, you guys are welcome to sit with me and we can do a quick Q&A. I know a lot of you have been um, wanting to do a Q&A. I will put a link in the description box to a sit under dryer for you guys. All right. It has a shine while wet. It must be, it's must going to be bomb dry. Look at it. No, that's very true, Vicky. If it's already shiny while it's wet, right? Then imagine what it's going to be when it's dry. Now, is it going to be as shiny as when it was wet? No, because water glistens, right? So you got to be realistic. Water glistens. It, it puts a glisten on, a glisten on things. Dry is dry. But once my hair is dry, I should still have a luster to my hair. Is it going to be as shiny as the chrome on one of those bottles? Absolutely not. That's not even possible. Okay, because the hair absorbs. So that's not possible. But it's still going to have that silky, shiny luster to it that hair can have. Thank you, Jador. Can you use the silk wrap foam on natural hair, not relaxed? Uh, yeah, you can use it, but is it going to lay the hair down when you're natural? Not as well as it would when you're relaxed, but it can be used for your twist outs. It can be used for stuff like that. Yes. All right, you guys, if you have any hair care questions now, is definitely the time to ask.
Now, I know a lot of you are going to be like, okay, so when is it going to be ready? When is it going to be released? When is it going to be this? When is it going to be that? <laughs> We're working on the release date. How long did I stay under the dryer when I did the treatment? 15 minutes. 15 minutes under a heated hooded dryer. The new serum. So the only new serum we have is going to be the Super Growth. This is not a water-based formula, but it is still a Super Growth hair growth hair retention formula, and it is water-based. Okay, it is water-based. So I'm going to show you guys on my hand when I say water-based what that means. That is water. So the hair will quickly absorb it and the rest will dissipate. Okay. Our Goddess Hair Repair Serum is still a oil-based serum. So once I put oil on my hand, there's a huge difference because the oil does not dissipate. Okay. Oil, water. Oil, water so if you guys notice the water-based formula absorbs very quickly the oil-based formula sits and coats the actual cuticle i'm just rubbing my, my oil on my skin <laughs> all right let me go back to the questions my website is elitehaircareusa.com hi fiji I don't understand when you say dipping your hair always comes in the back. When is the goddess polish coming back? In February, please. We're working on a release date. If you use that after the ELT shampoo, then just use the leave-in. I just use the leave-in conditioner. Yeah, you go straight into your leave-in conditioner or if you want to soften your hair up some more, then you can just put a little bit of conditioner rinse it just comb through really quick rinse it right out that's just going to help to soften the hair up but you want it to be a lightweight conditioner i had my color done two weeks ago can i do a protein treatment my next wash day absolutely it was probably best that you got the protein treatment at the time of the color but not every stylist does that what did i tie my hair down with these are wrap strips What type of heat protectant product should I use before blow drying my hair? My hair is 3C natural. So our leave-in conditioners have heat protectant properties in it. After you complete the blow dry, then you can apply the first tamer and shine serum if you plan on doing any form of flat ironing. Does the water-based serum cause the hair to revert? It's water-based, so um, more than likely, yeah. It's still a water-based serum. So if you are natural with a silk press, would I use the water-based serum? Probably not. I use the oil-based serum. Saw that you was on, was live, ran and got my phone. It's 7 a.m. my time. Love watching your channel. Thank you, Cheryl. The Revive Serum is sold out. We're kind of figuring if we want to continue with the Revive Serum because it is a daily moisturizer. More than likely, yes, but as of right now, we're just not 100% sure. We're just kind of crunching the data on that one.
I won't be touring for any time at this point. Should you change your regimen or routine during the winter months with low porosity here? Yes, you're going to condition a lot more. Hold on, you guys. So my hair is drying. The top is slightly dry, still moist or somewhat wet. But I want you guys to be able to see my hair as it's drying.
All right, I'm gonna answer a couple questions and then I am going to get my day started. Pat Hall, that information can be found in our Elite Hair Care Professional Recipe book at EliteHairCareUSA.com. Is it bad to stretch your wash day to every two and a half weeks? No, it's not. What number should I use on the flat iron for 4B textured hair? Um, I mean, I use 450. It just depends. You got to really, if you're doing it every day, it's going to be different. But for me, I do 450. Is it okay to deep condition each week? I have not had a protein treatment in a while. I wouldn't say deep condition every week. Every two weeks should be good unless you work out. Um, but you can do a protein treatment like once every four to six weeks. Hey CJ, yep, we're doing great. I took my braids out and it was oily. That's sebum in the hair, that's normal. <coughs> Thank you. Three people that have not hit the thumbs up, please. <laughs> You're so funny. Thank you, you guys. All right, so I'm still drying my hair, but I want you guys to see my hair. So you can see. Okay, let me part it in the middle just a little bit. I don't want to mess up my mold. Okay, but my hair is still slightly damp. It feels nice and soft question is your shine treatment the same as a glossing treatment shine and glossing are exactly the same kind of word All right, you guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and get my day started. I hope everybody has a great remaining part of your day. Please don't forget the winter blowout sale is going on. Um, if you go to our website, EliteHairCareUSA.com and go under the sale tab, you will see that we have items anywhere between $5.99 and $9.99 um, during the winter blowout sale. Also, the Bluetooth cups are $19.99 and then our t-shirts are $15.99, the Goddess Lifestyle t-shirts. I hope everybody, like I said, has a great remainder of your day. And then once this video is done, I will post in the description box the link for the hooded dryer. Peace.